What's going on YouTube? Welcome to the channel and let's just jump right into it guys. Hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. We got a 2024 TRD off-road on 35s right here guys. What do you think about that? 35s, okay? We got 17 inch wheels wrapped around these Mickey Thompsons and they're gonna be 35, 12 and a half, 17 right there. And they got them on these nice bronze wheels. I really do like those a lot. This is a six foot bed and I think it looks really, really good lifted. The six foot bed definitely looks good lifted. And the white and the black accents look really good. I really like this truck a lot. What do you guys think? Let's actually see what a price we got on this baby. But we're opening it up inside and just see what we're working with on the inside because it does have these really nice white accents here. They look good. You got the TRD in white. And we're not gonna have power seats off the top right here. And you got four miles on this thing. It's nice. You got the big 14 inch screen, but you are gonna get some heated seats. So that's nice. At least you get the heated seats. And we'll swing it around here. They got a lot of these lifted ones up here. So we'll be looking at all of them today. So we'll be looking at a few more. So sit tight and I'll show you them. But yeah, this is the white and black one. It's gonna be a four by four here. And we'll kind of look at some poke here. You guys can kind of see. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be like a positive uh, 35 offset on these. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like a two and a half inch lift in the front. And let's get a price for this bad boy. All right. So it looks like it's gonna be 46,000, so almost 46.4. And here are your options that I already mentioned, 14 inch screen, and then you get the heated seats, and then you get mud guards. And then here's all your standard equipment right here. So if you're not aware of what actually comes on the TRD off-road, as far as standard equipment is. And then you're gonna get 21 combined and 19 in the city and 23 in the highway. And we'll just open it up real quick so you can see on this passenger side. So you get the Tacoma right here on the top of the white, which just looks really nice. And then you get that big 14 inch screen. No sunroof and no rear slider, okay? Now let's look at the new price because they added all this stuff. So you got 49,856 and, oh, they're doing a discount. So I'm glad, I'm glad I'm, I got that right here. So the discount is $1,500. I would still get them to try to take off a little bit more because they did add a lot of stuff to it. And what they added was a 1,515 bucks for your lift and then $3,500 for the wheels and tire setup, okay? So that's that. What do you guys think? So I'll kind of take you guys inside here and let you see. It's basically a spacer lift. And like I mentioned, it's probably gonna be two and a half inches up front and one inch in the back. And we'll just kind of go around it. So they do a lot of these builds. We're up here at Wilsonville Toyota and Wilsonville, Oregon. So make sure you guys holler at the crew. There's some of the guys right there. There's John Scott. He's one of the guys that actually does, if you can even see him, he's so far away, but that's John Scott over there. But anyway, that's not why you're here. So. Holler at him, holler at Yasser, and I'll leave everybody else's name in the description. They're really good folks up here, but that's not why you're here. So we got a six foot bed here, guys. And this is just one of the builds. Definitely a nice truck. I wish they would have blacked it out, but you know, they did leave you something to do. So if you do decide to pick up this truck, you can black out the tailgate if you choose to do that and get the black Tacoma in the back. So what do you guys think about this one? Okay. Good looking truck. So you are gonna get the blind spot indicators right here, but you're not gonna get the integrated turn signals. So no power seats and no rear slider. And you're obviously not gonna get a camera or anything like that. Let's look down low and see. It's a lot of ground clearance here. So here's underneath. And I'll kind of let you guys see, just kind of stretch the old back out. That suspension up front, like the double reservoir right there. So that's nice. So this is the first one, right? We're not gonna spend too much time across the street over here. Now we got a nice SR5 right here. This is a nice one. Not to be mistaken for a sport because you know you got the color matched fenders. This is a nice one. Let's see if we got any options on this one. Yep, we do. We have options on this one. Okay, so let's see exactly what we have. So they got a heated steering wheel and they got heated front seats on this one. And this is a SR5 and it's got 54 miles on it. All right, so still no power seat though on this one. And they have the TRD running boards here. I believe these are like cast iron. Yeah, you got a cast iron. Whoa, I'm always running into stuff. Running into a big old forerunner right there. Always running into stuff. I gotta be careful because I did just pick up the new uh, Jordan 4 Military 4. So I gotta be careful next time I come up here because I might be wearing those and I ain't trying to scuff them. So luckily I'm just scuffing up threes, but that's not why you're here. Why you're here is because you want to see a price. 
So the retail price of this one is getting up there, guys. $48,000 is the retail, almost $49,000. And there's that cold weather package. So you're gonna get the cold weather package basically. And then you got the deck rail cleats. And then what else you got? You got the bed steps, you got the cast iron uh, running board, and then you got the mini tie down, and then you got the tailgate insert. So I'll let you guys see all that stuff. It's a lot of options on this, and that's why it got all the way up to almost 49,000. But you are gonna get a huge discount. So they added, it looks like they added about 5,000, almost $6,000 worth of accessories. So the new price is gonna be $51,000. So almost 52,000, but they did take off close to $2,500, as you can see right there. Almost $2,500 off. So let's see what exactly what they did to it. So they got a ready lift for 800 bucks, and then your wheels and tires ran you $3,156, and then that roof rack ran you 1550. Five. All right, so let's step back and let's just take a look at their work. And then we'll dive in into these wheels because this is like the wheel and tire set up here. All right, let's see what they're working with here. I believe this is probably like some 33s. Yeah, this is just 33s, 285, 70, 17 on the KMC wheels. All right. And then I'll take you guys up top here and let you guys see that OEM Toyota roof rack. It looks good. It's definitely, it's definitely grown on me. And like I always say, it's a lot better than the one that was on the third gen. So we won't spend too much time here, but this is in that underground color. One of my favorite colors and uh, Toyota definitely made a lot of these in underground, okay? So with this one, you are gonna get uh, a rear slider, which is nice that you get that with the cold weather package. And you're gonna get a composite bed here. So with the uh, textured bed, it actually, it's, they're all composite, but this is gonna be a textured one. And it says Tacoma in the back. And this looks like about a positive 25 on the offset. So they probably did a, a one and a half inch lift just in the front. So typically they don't have to do anything in the back if they just do a one and a half inch lift in the front. And then we'll look at a price again on this one just in case you guys forgot. So the new price is 51,866. So when they took off almost $2,500. So as I mentioned to you guys, make sure you do some negotiating, you know, try to get a better deal. So they do have it blacked out and there's that bed step right there. There's the bed step. And then there's those TRD running boards, the cast iron. All right, let's keep it moving. Let's see what else they got. Let's see what else they got. So that's two. I feel like they got, they got one more up here. I think that's that limited edition Tundra over there. Yeah, that's that limited edition Tundra right there. Limited edition 1774 with the Fox suspension. Okay, so we got another one. So I told you they're doing a lot of these uh, Tacomas in underground. So you will see a lot of undergrounds out there on the road. And speaking of, you know, last month they sold over 15,000 of these nationwide. So selling about 500 of these Tacomas a day nationwide. This is a good one because this is a sport. It's looking real sporty. It's looking real sporty. Okay. I like this one here. Let's see what we're working with. Let's see what it came with from the factory. So you got heated front seats and you got the 14 inch screen. Okay. And you got mud guards and you got the door edge guard and it's locked. Okay. So let's see what we're working with. So you got $1,500 on the ready lift and then your Mickey Tom Thomas Thompson tires and Rhino Shogun wheels ran you almost $4,000. Okay. I don't know why I was struggling on the Mickey Thompson right there, but anyway, so let's look at this and see what we're working with. So these are gonna be 35s, guys, 35s. And this is the kind of poke you're gonna get. So what do you think? I don't know what it is, but uh, maybe it's a different offset, but these ones don't look this, it doesn't look like you get as much poke as you did on that white one for whatever reason. I'm not sure it could just be me, but um, I definitely like this sport. This is a nice looking truck. It really looks good. Let me make it a little bit bigger so we can kind of get a better picture, but yeah, these are the dealership builds that they're doing up here. So we got three of them just sitting on the lot and uh, just made them. They're not sitting on the lawn. <laughs> he just there. made them. So he, hey, so this the one that you switched the wheels on was the other one. It's the oh, one over there, huh? Down there. Yeah. The so he, on it. the rack one. Okay. So they haven't been here sitting there that long. So I was exaggerating a little bit. 
He just made them. <laughs> he just made them. It's hot out here, you guys. But what I was saying was that other truck has been sitting here for a minute because he switched the wheels. And he didn't want to switch them, but he finally did. And it definitely looks 10 times better. It's definitely hot out here. I think we're about to be at like almost 80, almost 90 degrees out here today. It's very hot. I'm starting to sweat. So this is probably going to do it for this one, guys. But let's open up the tailgate and see what kind of... We're not going to open up the tailgate. But you do get lights. There's no type of power outlet and there's no sliders. So that was John Scott. So if you're looking to get a vehicle, make sure you holler at him. So what do you guys think about these dealership builds? Would you prefer to just buy your truck and then do your own lift yourself, add your wheels and tires? The good thing about if you do get a dealership build, you know, you can try to get a discount. Let's see what kind of discount that they have on this one that they offered. So they offered just 1500 bucks off of this one, almost 1600. I would definitely try to get them to see if they could have a little bit more wiggle room on something like this. And I'm about to run into something else again. So yeah, guys, what do you think? What do you think? Which one is your favorite one so far that I've showed you? So I'm gonna definitely have to take me a break because I'm out here sweating, sweating like a dog. What's going on, Brian? Right, make some deals, my man, you right. ready? Not quite yet, man. All right, you I'm gonna send some people your way though. All right. That's Brian right there, you guys, holler at him. He's one of the sales managers over here. And we are at Wilsonville Toyota in Wilsonville, Oregon. But yeah, I like this one. I think, I think this one will probably be my pick my pick and um you guys know my memory shot so let me see if i was going to pick this how much money would i be spending yeah fifty thousand, y'all fifty thousand. so basically all the new tacomas when they're all hooked up it's going to be like fifty thousand. so which is crazy but fifty thousand dollars in this economy doesn't must not be a lot these days but that's gonna do it guys so i definitely this is definitely my pick i think this one or the six foot bed I definitely like the Sport way better than the um, the SR5. And let's kind of look at these black Rhino wheels. And you know, then the Baja Bosses. I like the tread pattern. I definitely like the tread pattern. So no, no power seats, no rear sliding window on this one at all. And you get no power lifting tailgate, obviously. But that's going to do it, guys. Have a good day and God bless. Thanks for checking out the channel. Peace.